Hello ladies and gentlemen. Can a crime drama happen through a deck of cards? Why yes it can. Check this out baby. Alright. These are two detective cards from Boston, Massachusetts, Mr. Jack of Diamonds. And from the heart of Compton, California, Mr. Jack Hart. Alright. Those, my friends, are the detective cards. And a card, out of all these different cards, mixed and so on, uh, a criminal card will be taken. Now, I don't want the Jacks to see the card either, so I'll cover them. And what you see, this is the criminal, the criminal card. And the card can be put anywhere in the center uh, the person so chooses to desire. And the cards are mixed. And so on. Nice mess, as I like to call it. Give them another shuffle. Take the cards, give them a few cuts. Make sure that card really is lost in the deck. Now, I would have someone cut the cards anywhere they want in the deck. So they do, let's say they cut here. And you see the two single jacks go face up in the deck as they search. And they are face up for the criminal card. And I will go through just to show all you Downton Thomases that the Jacks really, truly, legitimately are face up and they're next to each other. The only cards face up. I'll have the person say, I want you to say, Jack of Hearts, Jack of Diamonds, find my, and they would go ahead and do that. And if you look, those jacks are fast. Look, one card is between the jacks. Yes, indeed. One card, one card only. And I showed you the jacks were face up to the very last second, and they have indeed caught the criminal by the spades, bringing justice and order to the world. Thank you and God bless. Peace to your mother.